I refuse to call myself a victim. After fleeing my narcissistic relationship, I have a story to tell. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is Teresa, AKA 50 plus 2013. Okay guys, this is quick tip and I'm serious. Follow your gut feeling. When you're in a relationship and you feel like something is not quite right, you need to pay attention to that. Gut feelings, intuition, whatever you want to call it, it's there for a reason. I, in the past, did not know or want to listen to my gut feeling and I paid for it. I paid for it by getting myself in relationships that were not good for me. And as it stands right now, you realize that I have just recently fleed a narcissist relationship and my gut feeling was telling me something wasn't right almost from day one, just out of a conversation that made me just think to myself, what, 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 what? You know, pay attention. And I'm gonna list some things specifically in the bar below that I experience as far as something is not quite right, my gut feeling, and why didn't I know that this was a sign letting me know that this is not the relationship for me. I'm not sad. I did waste a great deal of my t life in this relationship, but I'm not really sad like, oh, poor, well, I'm not having a pity party about it because this can happen to the best of us. Trust me, if you think that you're in a narcissistic relationship based on some things that I've shared here on my YouTube channel, well, you might need to look up the word and then maybe listen, look at some videos on it, some psychologist takes on it, and then decide whether or not you're in this relationship, and then once again flee. You don't have to end up being in a relationship for the years that I've been in, and then you finally find out what this thing is that you should have never gotten involved with. A narcissist have no feelings. You would never be satisfied in a narcissistic relationship. They just don't have anything to give. So once again, this is tip, please flee from the narcissist. Thank you so much for watching the video. And unfortunately, this is a real subject. And there are people out there that are just never gonna be the same behind living with a the narcissist. They are very cruel and brutal, brutal people. They are people that are lost souls that need help, need deliverance. So if you are able to get out of the relationship, please don't feel like you can go back. They'll change, you'll change. This is a situation where a person needs psychiatric treatment because layers have to be peeled back that caused this person to become the extreme. Um, and also, if you belong to a church or, or a fellowship where people believe in praying for you, laying hands on you, you can get delivered from this. This is not a death sentence, but I just wanna say thank you for watching the video to the end. I am one of the truly blessed ones and I praise and thank the Lord for that. So at this time, I just want to say thank you for watching the video and I will see you on my next one.